I'm sticking to this tree no matter what. I'm afraid we can't go anywhere either. Our egg is about to hatch, so I sealed up our nest to keep them safe. Them? Are you saying Mrs Hornbill is sealed inside there too? Only for five months? Just until our chick is old enough to fly? It's not so bad. There's a little hole where I bring them food. But they're not going anywhere for now. We can't risk harming the hornbills. Looks like we'll have to move this tree upright. It'll be a little wobbly, Kip. But the Cherub One can handle it. I can use my map to lead you on the smoothest path to the safest location, just across the river. Excellent. Wazi and I will stay behind to make sure a teeth doesn't follow you. Careful around the roots, Tweak. Whoa! Careful! Sorry about that, Mrs. Hornbill. We'll be fine. Just as soon as we make it across that rope bridge. Hey! Where'd my scratching tree go? Now, Atif, I'm sorry, but the creatures in that tree were in danger, so we had to move it. Plenty more trees in the forest, matey. We can help you find one, like this one. Sleek, stylish, a real itch scratcher. But I want my scratching tree. <sighs> hey! Come back with that. <sighs> That's it, Tweak. Slow and steady. Yes, steady is good. Please be careful. My wife and chick are inside. Uh, I can do the slow part, but not so sure about steady. <laughs> oh, no, no. Forget slow. A teeth is right at our tail. Hold on, a teeth. Let me pass. That's my scratching tree. No can do, matey. There are creatures in that snag. Oh, no! Tweak, open the hatch! Above and beyond! 